Stampers, welcome to another Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stamp and Jill Creative team, and today I'm excited to share with you a bundle that's new in the annual catalog. So it is this hand drawn blooms with the banner blooms dies. I love the floral look in this. I love the fun, bright paper that actually comes in the suite and all the cute samples that are in the catalog here. It's on page 130 and 131 with the stamp set on 132. And there's actually this sample on page 132 that I was really inspired by. So I wanted to kind of take that and make it my own. So I wanna show you what I did with that. So let me bring that in. I have just this, this big flower die piece cut, cut out of Whisper White. Now the cool thing about this stamp set is that it coordinates really well with the die. So it has different sayings in here that um, go on this cute little banner. So I'm gonna stamp first of all with Pretty Peacock. I'm just gonna stamp congratulations on your special day right on that banner, just like that, okay. And then I am going to take my water painters. Now these are new water painters. They are so, so nice. They come in a set of three and there's three different sizes in there. I'm going to use the smallest size for this project because what I'm coloring is pretty intricate. So I have a few different colors. I'm gonna start with my Just Jade and I'm gonna use that, my green, for the stems and the leaves to watercolor that. And I'm just gonna kinda give it a wash over the top, just like that. And I'm gonna do that on all of that greenery part. I'll leave a little bit to the imagination there. Next, I'm going to use Calypso Coral. Now on the, with the Calypso Coral, I did these bigger flowers in here. And I just kind of did the same. I just colored them, colored them with my water painter. And it just gives it a really cool washy look. So pretty. Okay. Next, I want to do Daffodil Delight. I used this on more of these, this sunflowery looking flower here. I thought that went well with that. Give it a good wash all over. And then the last color I used was Flirty Flamingo. And I did my little itsy flowers with the Flirty Flamingo, like that, okay? Now, obviously I colored the whole thing. <laughs> so it was a little more done than this, but I just wanted to give you a little idea of what I did. Then I took the Wink of Stella, this um, shimmer, and I just kind of went over the flowers with it. So it gave it just a little bit of a glow on the flowers. You could also do the whole thing and it would just pop right out of there. So pretty. Okay, so let me bring in the finished one and you can see a little bit better how it turned out. So I stamped on the back of a piece of Pretty Peacock cardstock and then put it over the top of it and added some pretty rhinestones here. And it turned out so fun. I loved the watercolor look of that die. So pretty. So let me show you a few other samples that I've made using this bundle. I used our rainbow glimmer paper and cut it out um, with that die, so pretty. And really that does all the work for you there. So fun. And then I love this stamp in the Hand Drawn Blooms set. And I watercolored this one here, so pretty. And then another one, I did this using the blend so it's really bright and pops fun. Cute. Oh, and I did this all with the new in colors, so that was fun too. So fun. So I have loved playing with this set. It's such a beautiful one, um, a beautiful bundle of products. Don't forget that if you bundle select products in the catalog, 
that you can get 10% off of those products. This bundle has been one of my favorites to play with. I've loved it and I can't wait to play with it some more and get some more samples. I hope you've loved this bundle as much as I have and we'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.